Okay, guys. Welcome to Children's Chapel. The first thing we do is light our candle and find where we are on our mountain spiral. Okay, we started on Ash Wednesday. We had Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and it was the first Sunday in Lent. Now we can sing for the whole week. Ready? Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Then it was the second Sunday in Lent. We can sing again. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Then it was the third Sunday in Lent. We just sing one more time. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Till it's now the third, fourth, let's see. One, two, three, fourth Sunday in Lent. Wait, right, no tomorrow Sunday. Mm hmm We're having a children's chapel a little early, but here we go. And that's where we are, making our way all the way until we get to Holy Week and then Easter. Yay! Today we have a story, and it was a story that Jesus told. This I had the people, Hold I on. have my guy. I'm using can one guy. guy. Jesus guy? said to his people, can I, can I have my guy? Oh, he was going to be my special guy. Can I, can I? You can hold him. Ricky, do you want to pick one to hold? There we go. All right, listen up. Ready? Jesus said, take care. Be careful of greed of any kind. Yeah, well, well, this is yeah. Yeah. Because life, oh, is this Jesus? Okay. He said, no, can I have yeah, can you hold him? I said, he says, life is about more than the stuff that you own. And then he said, let me tell you a story. This is a story about a rich man whose fields produce so much good food. So much good food that he thought to himself, I have no place to put all this good food. I have only this little barn. This little barn? He thought, what are they going to do? And then he said, I know what I will do. I will knock down this little barn and I will build a big storehouse. And in that storehouse, I will keep all of my plentiful grain and all of my goods. And I will say to myself, self, you have plenty of grain. Relax, eat, drink, and be merry. You have it made. And God said, you fool. This, yeah, you fool. He said, oh no, this very night your life is demanded of you. And what will happen to all of the things that you stored up? What are, the good, are they to you when you're dead? And Jesus said, so it is with people who store up treasure here and are stingy to God. And he said to his friends, here's Jesus talking again, he said to his friends, therefore, do not worry. Do not worry about your life or your body because life is more than what you eat and the body is more than what you wear. The end. Thank no, you. Do it back, do it back. Do you want to knock down? Is it down? the end? It's the end. Yay! Yay! Yeah. Yeah. I know. You did it. Here we go. We might. So Fritz, have I you need have you heard about um, that people seem really anxious? Do we seem really anxious <gasps> these days? Have we bought a lot of extra groceries? Yeah. It's not time yet. Have we bought a lot of extra groceries? Yeah. Yeah. And oh, no. you know what I have coming? Every few weeks, I have a whole bunch of diapers come in the mail, even if we don't need them yet. I just have them come. Isn't that silly? And sometimes we don't need them. But you know why? Every... I don't need a diaper. No, I know they're for miles. We don't even need that many, but I buy so many because I think, I think, if I have so many diapers, then nothing bad can happen because I'll be ready for it, right? But is that what God is, was telling us in this parable from the Bible? No. Who's in charge? Am I in charge? Do I control the world? If I have enough diapers, can I make sure that Miles will never have an accident or never get hurt? No. Who's in charge? Jesus. Yeah, God is in charge. And God tells us, does he tell us, 
Go out and buy all the groceries you can and keep all your toys to yourself and never share. No, God says, do not be anxious because God takes care of us. But my nurse do take my wool. Sometimes he borrows your toys. But no, all things... my wool. Yeah, that's really tough, Ruthie. Yeah. I know, it's really tough when someone takes something that's yours. But you know what all things? All things come from God. Yeah. Yeah. So we, so we don't need to worry about whether we have enough food or whether we have enough clothes or whether I have enough diapers for my home. Yeah. Even when things seem scary, we know that God is in charge and taking care of us. Okay, can we sing our Lent song before we blow out the candle? Do, 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 do. You have to really sing it if you want to be the one to blow it out. Lord, throughout these 40 days for us did fast and pray, teach us with thee to mourn our sins and close by thee to stay. Yay! Good job, guys. <clears throat> we both did it. No, we didn't. I want to hide. Should I stop recording? Yes, please.